what is up YouTube? We are back here. It's Marvel Girl 96 and we are playing some more Bendy in the Ink Machine so we can get ready for the Dark Revival. We've already done chapter 1 and chapter 2. If you haven't seen them yet, go ahead and check them out so that we are all caught up. And let's go ahead and do chapter 3. Wait, which is my save? This one, yeah. Apparently I left off at chapter 3 on the other one. Alright. This is my least favorite chapter. I mean, the areas and stuff are really cool. It's just, it gets a little repetitive. But now that I've played it as many times as I have, I kind of know what I'm doing. Knock on wood, we'll see when I get there. Because it has been a bit. But I can usually bust it out faster than the very first time I played. Because the very first time I played was kind of exhausting, but I like this level. I like the toy shop. I like Alice Angel. It's just her assignments are so tedious. And that's the thing that drives me crazy. So, yeah. Other than that, like I said, I like this level a lot. I love Boris and all that. It's just, I hate the part with Alice, but we will get through this together. I finished the whole entire Lost Ones book. Freaking fantastic. Chapter 3, Rise and Fall. So yeah, I, I finished the, um, the whole Lost Ones book. They're all so good, it's really hard to say. I mean, like, part of me wants to say it's the best book out so far from the Bendy series, but then the other part of me doesn't want to say that because I just freaking love the first one. You know, dreams come true so much, and then the illusion of living is just so cleverly done. I don't know. If you haven't read the books and you're a Bendy fan, then are you even a Bendy fan? Because the books are just amazing. All right. All right. I already forgot how to play again. Okay, I don't think I can go in there yet, so... Nice clock! I like it! We got a plane, we got a little helmet, we got a bone. Very cool! Okay. Whatever that thing is. Hey, Boris! He's so cute. I love him. I have a Boris. I have a Boris Pop, a Dark Alice Pop, a Bendy Plushy Pop, and I believe. Oh, and a Sammy. I have a Sammy Lawrence Pop. Need to open the door, but the lever is missing. Boris probably has it. Boris probably has it. Boris, do you have it? I love Boris. He's so cool. He's amazing. Boris rules. I wrote you a song. Hey, buddy. You seen that lever handle around? Or are you holding it hostage until I make you something to eat? I thought so. Let's see what we got. Really jamming out? How do you bend your elbow so far back like that? Boris versus Henry. Which I'm Henry. So that's some tea right there. How many games have we played together, Boris? I like your make do candle holder. It's actually pretty nice. I enjoy that. All right, so you want some soup. And we've seen this, uh, we also saw this in the Boris Dark Revival game, which uh, is essentially his self-portrait of himself, basically. Because I don't know if you've read the book, so I won't spoil anything, but you should totally read them because you can learn a lot about Boris, and that's all I will say. I know there's one in his room.
I remember there's like some kind of trick with the bone, but I forget how to do it. That should be enough. Yeah, I can't pick it up. And you have to do something special. I I've done it before. So I think it was a trophy or I just tried it. Nice underwear, too. <laughs> I like it. But, uh, I know you can get the bone in his mouth, but I just don't remember how to do it. Here's your soup, friend. There you go. So you're not even gonna eat it? Fine. Fine. Just stare at it then. Let's see what's out there. Don't want to Pretty sure Boris locks that door and hides the handle for a specific reason. <laughs> and you're like, hey, get oh my god, Boris. You're breathing down my freaking neck. Good lord. Little Miracle Station. I never really understand exactly what these are. Like, are they actually a bathroom? Cause like, if you got a quick peek inside, it's just a bench. Like, I don't even, I don't understand what they actually are. Like, I understand you hide from the Ink Demon, but like, what do they actually do? Let's find some light. Okay, got my flashlight. You gotta make sure you don't walk too fast here because... No, I'm recording! <laughs> it's okay! Um, um, you gotta make sure you um, don't walk too fast because uh, Boris is afraid of the dark. My mom thought I was talking to her. She's upstairs, she's like, are you talking to me? Yeah, see? So now he was walking farther ahead than me. And then he freezes. Did you hear that? Yeah, me either. We survive, Boris. Another dead end. I don't see any other way through. You got any ideas, Boris? Talk to Boris. Bye, Boris. Thank you, my good man. You see, this part's cool. Wow. I don't remember any of this. Well, when you read the, um, uh, Illusion of Living from Joey Drew, and it's supposed to be, um, an autobiography that he wrote. <laughs> Spooky. It, uh, essentially explains, like, how he met all the crew. Hell firefighter. Hell in a hard basket. <laughs> okay. Uh, we already read those two. And it just, um, it explains, like, how he met everybody. Sammy, and Alice, and, uh, what is the other one? Is that one? Susie is the first Alice, I believe. And, you know, it, it describes how he met them, and, like, it ex described Henry as well. And, I mean, Henry pretty much came up with the whole design. Like, he basically created 
bendy the way he would look. Like, oh, Joey Drew came up with the that. idea of what he wanted the comic to be, and he knew he wanted, like, this little character, but Henry invented what he looks like. And, uh... Henry really did not work there that long, which that's who we're playing, Henry. So, you know, I find that very interesting how you got to learn the history between him and Joey. Um, and how he really didn't do much. Alright, so if I remember how to do this correctly. If I put this on an ink machine, I'm going to be able to unlock a secret for you guys. And so we keep it on the ink machine. I love that he actually got to be in the third part. I think that's so cool. And then, well, he does some voiceover as well in the the Boris Dark Revival. So, what do I do to set this off? Or do I just walk over here? Hmm. I forget how to set this off. There we go. Gotta get these toys out of here. Again, it's pretty clear somebody barricaded this door on purpose. So, why are we uncovering it? I mean, this doesn't look like it happened by accident. They were shoving things in. There we go. Am I missing one? Ah, here. It's really shoved in there as an Alice head. There we go. And let me put this on. Cool. Yeah, you definitely got a lot of Alice merch. I mean, look, there's a couple Borises, but there's not that many. I mean, and then this is just a whole shelf of Alice. I think Joey really expected the character to really catch on and I don't know if, if she just came too late or it's just the fact that I mean they just really liked Bendy and Boris that she just didn't really catch on Think so? I Alice Angel. Alice Angel in Siren Serenade, presented by Silly Vision. Her dancing solo debut. This one's upside down. Bendy in Sent from Above with Alice Angel. She's she sings, she probably like dances. Um, oh, that's right here. She sings, she dances, yeah. Sent from above, not getting that vibe right now. She's quite a gal. T 
take the demon or the angel path. If I remembered correctly to unlock this little trick, you take the demon path. And I know that if I do this correctly, and if you follow exactly what I did, you will get a trophy if you have not done this already. And I'm pretty sure I'm doing it correctly. You take the devil path and you make that ink into the ink machine. So let's play this. Very silly. There's no way you could stop death. Right? You tell me, Joey. I'm pretty sure you know something I don't. Say, so why am I... Well, I can run... But now I'm at the por the parts where the ink demon will hear me. Oof. <laughs> that gave me a slight jump scare. Boris! Boris, how could you? I forgot Boris. about that part. Oh, you're scaring me to death. Don't suppose you found anything we can use to protect ourselves with. This will do. <laughs> Thank you. I'm not gonna hit Boris. I love him too much. No! You can't break those. Not cool. Hehe. <laughs> I love it. Boris is walking like we can actually Looks get like out of here. I need to throw two levers at once. You get this one. I'll find the other. <laughs> the butcher gang. So keep in mind, this is what they look like, okay? This is what they're supposed to look like. They're just dudes and a spider. So, like, what happens to them now? I have no idea. Come on. What? How'd he do that? How long has he been in there? Has he just been waiting for me this whole time? Ten years later, he's like, checking his watch. Almost time. Well done. Some soup, Boris. You almost made me walk past the soup. I haven't been paying attention. I probably missed the soup. There's no way I'm ever getting that trophy of finding all the soup. Here's the hell in... Hell in a hand basket. There's like a lot going on in this picture. Bendy and Boris go to hell in a hand basket. Presented by Silly Vision. Sounds charming. Can't go potty. Level K. Can't go in there. You sure about this, Boris? So different. I have to say, I'm an instant fan. How did you get on here so fast? Oh my god, Boris, did you hear that? I have a date. Does my hair look okay? Anything in my teeth? No? Sweet. Oh, 
There's a whole twisted world out here. <laughs> Thomas! Boris, I don't think we should like run in there, but Look at it. Uh. Come on, Boris. It took so many of them to make me so beautiful. Anything less than perfect is left behind. I had to do it. I looked it up before, and she's actually played by two different voice actresses. It's one voice actress that plays the dark version of her, and then the other one plays the half-human version of her, which I thought was really interesting. But then they still sound similar, but different enough to tell. I was right, Susie Campbell, that's her name. Creepy. Okay, girl. She's so sweet. I'm so excited for our date.
My machines are hungry. Gather me some spare parts. Okay. You got it, girl. <laughs> what level was that on? Level K. Okay. Can do, can do, can do. There are so few rules to our world now. So little truth. Watching in. But there is one rule we all know and respect down here. Beware the ink team. Stay out in the open for too long and he will find you. But if you see him, you'd better hide. If you don't, well, I enjoy our day. Now, Boris. let us begin our work. Boris, she said she's already enjoying our date. We haven't even gone out yet and she's already enjoying my company. Yeah, see, she's basically telling me not to run the whole time. Which... Sucks. <laughs> this one's empty. Dang it. Where's it? What? Where? Okay. Nothing in here. What the heck? It's not gonna let you do that because that's one of her last tasks, if I'm not mistaken. It's two down. I don't think it's in here. No. I don't think it goes that far back. Not for that, anyway. It's in here somewhere. There we go. That should be plenty. Return them to me. Okay. And try not to die on the way back. I'm going to try really hard. What the heck? Where'd you go? Okay. What the heck, Boris? You couldn't have waited? I was gone like 10 minutes. Not even. Confused, like exactly who she's in. Like she's, it seems like she's like in love with Joey and also in love with Sammy. Like I don't know if she That's just kind of did what she had to do to get like in this business. Cause it's just like she talks about how Sammy thought that she was wonderful and how he's handsome and Joey Drew's a very charming man and then whispers about how she likes when he calls her Alice. I mean, like, I don't even know. Mm-hmm. If you're gonna catch them, You'll have to learn to move quietly. Come back to my door. I have something that you'll need. Okay. Poke. Pokety poke poke poke. Always on time. Yes, sir. Now you don't have the measles. What floor? 
11. I don't listen to a word she's saying, obviously. Oh, this is a gent elevator! T! They use that, that company a lot in the new book. I love that everything's in the game that's in the books. It's just perfect. Oh, hi. You see what, look, why does he look like this? Like, why? I'm sorry. Oh, he looks so sad. I feel bad now. Whoa! That one got me a bit. That was really loud for, like, no reason. Where is he? I hear him. She said I have to walk carefully. I hear him. He's not there. That freaking jump scared me. He was really loud. Holy crap. Where are you? I, I like here. Ah. Gotcha. If the ink's bad, then, like, what? Good lord! It jump scares me every time. That is so freaking loud for no reason. Can you not? I saw the projectionist. I will in a second. Come on. Why aren't you playing? There. here. Oh, no. Where is he? Ah. Oh. I'm good. Whew. That was scary. It's clearing up. We're okay. I gotta watch my noise. The tape is probably what did it. Alright, I believe I can get out this way. Huh, I was wrong. Okay. He probably went in like that ink blot right there. That's what I'm thinking. All right. Boris, let me in. I almost died and you don't even care. Mm-hmm. Jeez. Girl, you got some issues. She's quite a gal. I'll make this simple. Look for valve pads. Turn the little wheels. Then bring me their power cores. Please don't make me regret sparing you. I can always change my mind. Are you gonna let me out or? Oh, um, what? Why? Level P, I actually paid attention this time. Why can't I keep my pint? This is stupid. Always on time. P.
I don't want to work here anymore. I definitely can see why. Oh god, this thing sucks for hitting. Okay. Alright, that one's already open. Hello. Okay, thank you. He will set us free. This one's open too. Okay. Why are there so many bad guys when I only have a freaking plunger? Soup. Thank you. Okay, that one's open too. Oh, here. Finally. Okay. No. Can you grab it? Thank you. Give me some soup. Glug, glug, glug. Alright, so. We have one more to go. I don't really want to run because we had that really close call. So I'm just gonna take my sweet little time. Wait, I need to get in here. Okay, the door's back here. That's been open. Remember, this is there just in case I'd set him off. Come on, I know you're probably gonna pop up at me. You're gonna wait until I turn the crank. Fair enough. Going the right way? Nope, I'm not. No, I'm not even running. Okay. I'm just gonna run for it. We're almost there. How could you do this to me? They sure do, Susie. Yeet, 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 yeet. Here's your blob. You see those grinning demons? Let's remove them, shall we? Okay. I have just the tool to make this even more enjoyable. Ten of them. Okay. There's one down here. Come on. There you go. Sometimes you get stuck back there. 
definitely not going to run, because every time I break one of those, it irritates them in general, so. Is there any in here? Oh, I forgot about that little spot there. Feel familiar. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, there's none down here, but it's good I came back down here, because we did not walk back here. Jeez Louise. Here. Yeah, there's none down here either, so we gotta actually go to the toys. I just want to double check around here. And I'm glad I went down there and checked that out because I forgot about all that stuff. Clunk, where? Pipes a little splurtsy right there. Unfortunately, once you pick one, like, I don't know how to, like, get into an, in the other side, then. Like, I don't think you can. I'm Alice Angel. Excuse me. I don't like your tone of voice. Look, I'm sorry, but Alice says we can go on a date, so. Do, 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 do. done I think we just have to get hearts for her and then I think we're done I think
think. Missing a glove, friend. He looks good. He's doing good. Can you please leave? I kind of feel like Alice was setting me up for a trap, but there's no way because she said that we're going on a date, so oh might seem God. suspicious, but I still trust her. Boris, not again. <gasps> no. Ah! Get in! Oh, God. I'm going for it. I don't push just push a button, any button, I don't care what button. Okay, bye! Sorry, Boris. We're okay now, he's gone. Oh, he's still scared. I'm sorry. I better get over time for this. Okay, yeah, I think we're at our last part. Oh, that's right, we gotta do this. Yes, dear. You don't give me a weapon? Okay. I hear him, but I don't see him. Oh, here they come. You always have an advantage if you stay on top of the steps and just wait for them to come. Hey! There you go. So quiet. Like a welcoming grave. I like the silence. Don't you? Sure. Oh, I hate leaving work unfinished. Fortunately, I have you to pick up the pieces. But you have to go even deeper. Down, down, down into the abyss. Take the lift down. Now, if I did this correctly, yes! Okay, guys, so all you do is you form that ink blob into the ink machine and take the demon path. And you will be able to grab the machine gun. If you don't do that, when you grab the machine gun, it will turn into a blob. And she just gives you, I think, just a pipe or something. Uh, okay, so we gotta go all the way down to 14, right? Is this correct? Yeah, it is. Mm-hmm. 
There. <laughs> I didn't even see him. All right, so. Normally, when you play this, you should run like hell, but. Oh, crap. <laughs> we have this, so. And back here is a secret, if I remember correctly. Somewhere. And it's the other side. And I don't think he comes back to life either. Like, that's it. He's done. Why did it break that one and not this one? There. All right, we just gotta grab the hearts. And then I will show you what that little secret does, and then there's just her little part, and then I think we're good. Is he staying dead? Yeah. There. Bring them to me now. I don't like to wait. All right, let's go. What level's that on? Let's go to K. That's amazing. Okay, okay. I guess I can't turn it back off. And if I turn it, if I find them, I never found all the radios. If I find all the radios, I get a, a trophy. This is it. So, once you turn that valve, then you can come into this and find this secret tape, and you will get a trophy. Only two weeks into this company, and already it's gotten interesting. Joey is a man of ideas. And only ideas. When I agreed to start this whole thing with him, I thought there'd be a little more give and take. Instead, I give, and he takes. I haven't seen Linda for days now. Still, someone has to make this happen. When in doubt, just keep going, Henry. On the plus side, I've got a new character I think people are gonna love. 
<laughs> Wonder what character that was. Maybe it's, mm, it's probably Boris because I don't think he invented Alice. Alright, see what floor we're on. And take the elevator to Miss Alice. We're on level P. So level P. I couldn't remember, so it's it's off of level P. So off of level P, but you gotta get that crank down in the Ink Demons area. Oh, I very much did. Boris, she says she's gonna treasure our memories forever. No, Boris is my friend. So no second date then? Oh, he's trying to wake me up. Boris, turn around. Oh boy. Well, I mean that level is awesome. It's just very time consuming. So this episode's a little longer than usual. But for the support, have a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whatever time it is. I hope it's freaking fantastic. And I will catch you all later.